I am Uma Devi, working as an associate professor in the Department of Physics, Mother Teresa Women's University, Kodakanal. I would like to solve a problem in infrared spectroscopy, which is found in Fundamentals of Molecular Spectroscopy by Banwell. The problem is the vibrational frequency of hydrogen chloride, chlorine 35, is 2990.6 cm inverse. Without calculating the bond force constant, find the frequency for its isotopes hydrogen chloride, chlorine 37, deuterium chloride, chlorine 35, and deuterium chloride, chlorine 37. So, given that the vibrational frequency for hydrogen chloride, chlorine 35, is 2990.6 cm inverse, uh, the, frequent, the formula for the vibrational frequency is omega oscillation bar is equal to 1 by 2 pi c square root of k by mu where k is a force constant and mu is reduced mass and uh, that is equal to 2990.6 centimeter inverse now we have to find the frequency for its isotopes hydrogen chloride chlorine 37 and deuterium chloride chlorine 35 and deuterium chloride chlorine 37 without calculating the force constant if you consider the internuclear distance and the bond strength are unchanged by isotopes, the force constant is unchanged by its isotopes. And if you consider like this, the force constant in all the isotopes is same. So the, uh, we know that the atomic mass for hydrogen is 1.673 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. And uh, for deuterium, it is 3.344 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. For chlorine 35, it is 58.06 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. For chlorine 37, it is 61.38 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. Now we have to find the vibrational frequency for hydrogen chloride, chlorine 37. So the formula is omega bar is equal to 1 by 2 pi c square root of k by mu. It's for hydrogen chloride chlorine 37. If you compare this with the known value of hydrogen chloride for chlorine 35, then it is uh, 2990.6 centimeter inverse divided by omega bar of um, hydrogen chloride chlorine 37 is equal to uh, because we are considering the force constant is same in both the cases, since it is uh, because of isotopes, it's not uh, in, um, unchanged. Uh, therefore, it is square root of mu uh, hydrogen chloride chlorine 37 divided by mu hydrogen chloride chlorine 35. So, from this, we can find omega bar is equal to 2990.6 into square square root of mu corresponding to hydrogen chloride chlorine 35 divided by mu corresponding to hydrogen chloride chlorine 37. We know the formula for um, mu that is the reduced mass that is equal to m1 m2 divided by m1 plus m2. That is if you consider it for um, mu for hydrogen chloride chlorine 35 it is equal to mass of hydrogen and mass of chlorine 35 divide by mass of hydrogen plus mass of chlorine 35. So we know the formula for mass of hydrogen, uh, mass of hydro chlorine 35. So if you substitute this uh, in this equation, we can get 1.626 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. Similarly, if you calculate for the reduced mass of hydrogen chlorine, chlorine 37, it is equal to 1.629 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. So, if you substitute all these values in equation uh, 3, therefore, omega for hydrogen chlorine, chlorine uh, 37 is uh, 2,990.6 into 1.626 into 10 power minus 27 divided by 1.629 into 10 power minus 27, the square root, therefore, it's equal to 2987.8 cm inverse. Therefore, the vibrational frequency for hydrogen chlorine, chlorine 37 is 2987.8 cm inverse. You have to find the vibrational frequency for deuterium chlorine 
chlorine that is uh, deuterium chloride chlorine that is 5 mm, for this case you, you can compare this with the uh, hydrogen chloride chlorine 35 so the formula is omega bar is equal to 1 by 2 by c square root of k by mu here also the uh, force constant is uh, same uh, it won't change uh, because of the isotope because we are considering like that so it is um, Omega bar for deuterium chloride, chlorine 35 is equal to 2,990.6 square root of mu corresponding to hydrogen chloride, chlorine 35 divided by mu corresponding to deuterium chloride, chlorine 35. So, uh, here the reduced mass of deuterium chloride, chlorine 35 is equal to mass of deuterium, mass of chlorine 35 divided by mass of deuterium plus mass of chlorine 35. So, we know the formula, we know the value of mass. So, if you substitute, this is equal to 3.16 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. Already, we have calculated mu for hydrogen chlorine, chlorine chloride, chlorine 35, that is equal to 1.626 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. So, if you substitute all these values in equation 8, it is equal to, um, we can get 2000. 145.2 centimeter inverse. Therefore, the vibrational frequency for deuterium chloride chlorine 35 is 2145.2 centimeter inverse. Next is to find the vibrational frequency for deuterium chloride chlorine 37. Uh, here the formula is the same that is omega bar is equal to 1 by 2 by c square root of k by mu. Uh, in this case, we are comparing this with uh, deuterium chloride, chlorine 35. So, omega bar is equal to 2145.2 into square root of mu deuterium chloride, chlorine 37 divided by uh, mu deuterium chloride, chlorine 35. Here, if you calculate the reduced mass of deuterium chloride, chlorine 37, the formula is mass of deuterium divided into mass of chlorine 37 divided by mass of deuterium plus mass of chlorine 37. So, you know the value for the mass that is equal, if you substitute this, this value is equal to 3.17 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. So, similarly, uh, we already calculated uh, mu for deuterium chloride chlorine 35 that is equal to 3.16 into 10 power minus 27 kilogram. So, now you substitute this value. Uh, in equation 11, it becomes, um, it is equal to 2,148.6 cm inverse. Therefore, the vibrational frequency for deuterium chloride, chlorine 37 is 2,148.6 cm inverse. Therefore, uh, the vibrational frequency for hydrogen chlorine chloride, chlorine 37 is 2,987.8 cm inverse uh, for uh, deuterium chloride chlorine 35 is 2,145.2 cm inverse deuterium chloride chloride 37 is 2,148.6 cm inverse thank you